This is a video on testing for a correlation. The question states, is there a correlation between class size and grades? The data are shown below. Use a level of significance, alpha, equals 0 0.05. So here are the data. We have class size, and we have the grades, or the grade point average. So notice for a class size of 12, the average grade point average for that class was 3.2, etc. So I want to find out if there is a correlation. I'm going to run a hypothesis test. The null hypothesis to find out if there's a correlation is that the population correlation, which I call rho, is equal to zero. If there's no correlation, then that correlation is zero. The alternative hypothesis is that the population correlation is not equal to zero. So to test this hypothesis, I go to my calculator. So here's the calculator. First I enter the data. So I go to stat and then edit. Let's clear out the two lists. And for L1, I put in the size, the class size data, starting out with 12. Enter, then 15. Enter, etc., etc. And then the last one is 39. Enter. And then for L2, I put in the GPA data. So 3.2. Enter, and then 3.3, .3. enter, etc. And then finally 2.8, enter. Now to test the hypothesis, I go to stat, I go to tests. I want to test the hypothesis for linear regression. So that's lin reg t test. And I hit enter. The x list is L1. The y list is L2. Frequency is 1. Remember the alternative hypothesis was that the correlation rho for the population is not equal to 0. I'm not graphing, so I don't need to store anything into reg eq. I just go to calculate and hit enter. So for any hypothesis test, the most important number that we get is the p-value. So the p-value is about equal to 0 0.23. And for interest's sake, if I scroll down a bit, I find my correlation, and that's a sample correlation, which is negative point about 0.48. So let's go to the PowerPoint. Okay, here's the PowerPoint. I have the p-value was about equal to 0 0.23, and the correlation, the sample correlation, was about negative 0.48. What's important is that the p-value, which is about 0 0.23, is greater than the level of significance 0 0.05, which is alpha. And when the p-value is greater than the level of significance, I fail to reject the null hypothesis. And I can conclude that there is insufficient evidence to conclude that there is a linear correlation between class size and grades. And I'm done with the problem.